Um, well, I've been waiting to release this album for the last, I think, four months now. We've kept it a secret, so um, I've never been so excited on a project in my whole life. Um, I remember wanting to do something like this ever since I was a kid, and um, it like for me, this album has totally blown every expectation of what we thought we well I, what I thought I could do in a band you know and um it's it's gone from like level to level to level in our past albums in my opinion and then this album is just like the one that totally consumed all of our creativity and it consumed all of our lives for like the past four months you know and um I think it's a wonderful direction for our band and I think it's a wonder, wonderful direction for um, just to take the music for the fans you know that little go the extra mile um, I've, I'm totally in love with it all the boys are and I'm so happy to release it to everybody for me I've Always known the guys from uh, previous bands, all that sort of thing, um, playing shows together. And I've always, like, I've always loved and appreciated their older material. Uh, but for me, coming on board with, uh, with this and this project, uh, it all came down to, you know, what I thought of the album when I heard it and, uh, and how I received it for myself. Uh, and yeah, I think I was probably like, you know, I think I was maybe into like the second song of the album or something. And that was when it kind of clicked and I went, you know, this is actually something special. You know, this is not just, this is not just another record. This is seriously something amazing. And I want to be a part of it. I want to, you know, I want to take this all around the world. Well, join the band. Um... Yeah, I've known, known Richie, Brett and all the boys for a while, I've been friends, um, very, very positive kind of feeling from them um, and yeah, it's just, just really exciting to see how they work like, as musicians, being in a band with them, it was, yeah, it was a good, good experience so far, so. Well, the process was, um, it, it was pretty simple to begin with, really. Um, you know the boys. The boys came to me and said, um, "You know they, they knew me from for, from a while ago and just said, do you, do you we're in need of a guitarist? You know, do you want to do want to join?" And um, they were definitely on my radar for ages. And I you know I really wanted to take my music to the next level. So I just thought, fuck, why not? You know, this is a this is a great opportunity for me. Um, basically, from that moment on, it was just writing, 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 writing for for. Probably, you know, it was, it, it, we, we didn't have a lot of time to do it. So, you know, we, we probably had about two months before we were heading into the studio. So it was two months straight, um, basically every day. Um, yeah, every, <laughs> pretty much every hour of every day. Vultures Above, Lines Below is by far the best thing we have ever, ever, ever done. Um, I don't know that's cliche, extremely cliche to say as a band, because it's a new record and you've got to promote it, but I would happily give away every other album I've ever done if this one could see the light, you know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm so proud of it, I'm so proud of everyone who worked on it. Um, yeah, and it's just like, it, we, we finally feel we, we got it right and we were totally honest with ourselves um, and what the end result of that was, was a record where we're actually happy with it. We're actually, I can actually listen to this record on a daily basis yeah. where every other album, like once I'm finished recording it, I kind of, you know, you get over it. You've, you've heard it 50 million times already. This album I've had, you know, I've, I've listened to it every day since and I've, I still get re-pumped every time I hear it. So it's gotta be a good thing. <laughs>